Hey everybody, back with another video. So in today's video, we're gonna see a little bit of a different of a video. I wanted to check out your comedians. So this is the first time I'll be listening to an Australian comedian. I just haven't came across one. Sorry, I'm sure it'll be funny. So let's see how funny he is. His name is Coral Baron at Just For Laughs is the video. So let's check it out. All right, folks, Carl Baron is one of the- Hey, that's um, that dude from that movie called The Mall Cop, is that what that is? He's from King of the Hill. Yeah, he's a comedian too. The fastest rising comedy stars out of Australia, you know Australia, right? They gave us Australia. that work and uh, Olivia Newton-John. Well, they sent us this guy to make up for it. So please welcome <laughs> Carl Barron. G'day. Hey, young. Good day, mate. Was uh, was he at the front looking at himself in the shop window? Do you do that? You pretend you're looking at something in the shop window, but actually you're just looking at your reflection. So you think, oh, that's a nice safer bed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I felt good. I got complimented today. Makes me feel good when I get complimented. It was only from the phone company. Still, out of the blue, they ring me up and go, Mr. Barron, you've got an outstanding account. <laughs> Thanks for notice, and no one else does. And the air hostess on the plane, you ever been asked this before? She come up to me and went, would you care for an orange juice? I said, if it needed me. <laughs> oh no, come on. shop that I had one of those signs on the, on the wall, we don't accept checks. To avoid embarrassment, please do not ask. But what's so embarrassing about that? What, you ever see them walk in a shop and go, yeah, g'day mate, how you going? Do you take checks? You don't. When you go for a drive down the coast, there's all the heaps of wildlife in Australia. See all these signs all everywhere? Koalas crossing, but you never see any. I wait for them. <laughs> oh my I god. I expect to see them on the side of the road going like this. <laughs> Not one. There's a sign in Queensland. Queensland's up the north of Australia. Yeah, in Queensland it's known for people being a bit slow and stupid. That's where I come from. I don't see it. <laughs> There's a sign up there that says koalas cross from 4 p.m. to 6 p.m. Oh my god. Is that true? That's pretty precise for a koala. <laughs> and there's a sign, I'm not, I'm not joking, that says injured wildlife, found this number. I'd like to see that. I like. Yeah, mate, I'm a kangaroo. <laughs> I'm a dickhead. Bring me over. Well, I'm a bit grey and flat, actually. Yeah, I'll wait here. <laughs> I, got, uh, I got my driver's license back the other day. I never get a good picture of my driver's license. You get I don't it back either. and think, what happened? <laughs> I don't remember posing like that. I think they got some special machine there that makes it look like a dickhead. <laughs> it's a little button on the floor. Smile, eh? Huh? <laughs> My picture this year, I'm looking up. Right up there, that's something you always do when you get your photo. Smile, wait a minute. <laughs> My cheeks are sucked in because I was going through one of my vegetarian phases. There's this mark on my head, looks like a bullet hole. I look dead, my picture looks like this. <laughs> that's my ID for five years. If I go out somewhere, like, you got ID, mate? Oh, shit, there you go. What? Oh, hang on.
ever burp with your mouth shut? You know, yeah. you go on a date and you get a burp and you don't want to burp in front of your date, you think, I'll just burp with my mouth shut. Doesn't go away. Ends up coming out somewhere it's not supposed to. You done those little Coca-Cola burps that come out your nose and your eyeballs? <laughs> Thinking, shit, his head's gonna explode. I feel like I've done it before. You know, sometimes people talk, and when they talk, they get a yawn, they try and hide their yawn, they keep talking, mm -hmm. they think they've hidden it from us. And so this guy's funny. It's like a lot of it is due to his face expressions that he's doing. It's hilarious. Mm, that's attractive. <laughs> you know, some of my friends talk to me and they, they talk and then they get a yawn and they keep talking and, and, and we're supposed to understand the yawn words. Oh, it's usually be pretty good if you get this camera. <laughs> yeah, I do that sometimes too. That's funny. Again. You know, sometimes you're talking to somebody and a little bit of spit comes out of your mouth and it lands on them. And you both see it happen because you both go, Whoop. You're thinking, Whoops, I got him. And he's thinking, Whoops, he got me. <laughs> but no one says anything because yeah. it's a secret. Then you rub it off. If it lands on me, I don't wipe it straight away because I don't want him to get embarrassed. Hey, I've got his spit on my face. I'm worried about his feelings. Yes. Is she texting? Oh, come on. You know, I sit at home all day and I don't fart once. I go on a date and I've got 20 in the bank straight away. Oh, so where do they come from? You don't let them out, they still happen in here. There's internal noise. You know, is that me or you? Like, are you? Do you ever do those secret farts at the supermarket and quickly piss off the other aisle? Oh, yeah. I don't do it that often, guys. Nope. Oh, shit, it's mine. My friends, my friends in Queensland like to tell me before they're going to fart like it's important or something. Yeah, you know, when they get excited, oh, jeez, I've got to fart. Well, they tell you after they've done it, oh, I just farted. No one ever tells you while they're doing it. That'd be a bit weird going, I'm farting. <laughs> Finger. I think I've got my underpants on back at the front. Well, what happened so quick? You ever do that? You got the big bit at the front? And then shit, am I shrinking a lot? There's extra room, what's going on? You see people when they when they scratch their bum in the street, they always get on one tiptoe and they look down. And they look really serious when they're doing it too. They're happy walking along, they start scratching, they get all serious. You know why? Because if you're laughing at a good time, then none of work. <laughs> oh, I better go. I better go. The lights on. I used to be a roof tiler before I did this for 13 years. Ooh, that's right. Shit job. I remember on the first day I thought, this is a shit job. <laughs> Thought I'd give it 13 years. <laughs> See if it comes good enough, still shit at the end. <laughs> Just before I go, I'll tell you, uh, this girl the other night came up in the bar after a gig. Didn't know her. She goes, excuse me. I said, what? She goes, you know what? I said, no. <laughs> she said, you've got no ass. Damn. I said, thanks. <laughs> right. She didn't say it was small or flat. She said, you've got no ass. So I farted. <laughs> I said, where do you think that come from? I said, oh, that's funny. That was good. Oh, Mara, ladies and gentlemen, Mara, Mara! 
Paul Barron. That was funny, you guys. That was uh, my first encounter of a Australian comedian, and he was funny. What y'all think? Did y'all think it was funny? Is he is he a big comedian in Australia? Hmm, I wonder. Uh, it was mostly his expressions, also. I mean, everything that he was talking about was you know what everyone goes through from the day to day basis. Yeah, it's, it was funny. I liked it. He was funny. His timing was great. And some of the things he said. I don't necessarily do like the butt scratching one, but yeah, everything else, yeah, it was very relatable. So what'd y'all think about it? What was y'all's favorite joke or favorite bit about the, the video? But again, that was Carl Barton, an Australian comedian. Thanks for watching the video. Thanks for the support. Like the video if you want. Bye.